everyone. Good morning. Are you ready for a short story? I hope you are. Okay, so let's see what story do we have. We have the story which title is Audrey and the New Kid. All right, let's see. Written and illustrated by Dave Lamont. All right, so what is the story about? Remember, we have to think about the setting of the story. We have to think about who are the characters and what happened in the beginning, middle, and end of the story. Let's see. So, Audrey and the new kid. Audrey was always a bit different from other kids at school. Shook? Wow, the slide! A wormhole to another galaxy! Wow! Clap, clap, clap! Yay! Good job! Her teacher said lessons were never boring with Audrey in the classroom. Her classmate said, Audrey always seemed to stand out. Look at her. Her dog Ernie said, Ooh. Wow, the princess. Good job, love those colors. Nice. Audrey loved spending time with her friends. They appreciated her unique style and she encouraged them to reach for the sky. You are the castle uh, queen. I think we made the best ca sand castle ever. Look at those kids. When Audrey's teacher introduced a new student to the class, Audrey was excited. She was sure they would be the best friends. Audrey and her classmates thought the new girl was fascinating and mysterious. Her name was Maybelline and she had traveled to the four corners of Earth with her dad. Maybelline was good at inventing fun games at recess, and she had very quickly took the role of the leader. Don't jump here. The, uh, don't jump in the leaves yet. Go over there. No, not like that. Only red leaves in this pile. As time went on, Audrey began to suspect that Maybelline might be telling tall tales. Hmm. Wow. Ooh, everybody's excited. But the kids at school just couldn't get enough of Maybelline's stories. I like your flower, Maybelline. Look at Audrey. And one day on a class field trip to the zoo, Audrey decided that she had had enough. Is that story really true? She asked Maybelline. Of course it's true, said uh, Maybelline. My dad and I have adventures all the time. In fact, see that monkey over there? I'm going to rescue it. Hmm? Before Audrey and her classmates even realized what was happening, Mabelly had wrapped the loose wine and was swooping down into the monkey cluster. Is it safe? Audrey could see that Mabelly was in trouble. She figured it uh, was up to her to help. Woof! Grant! The two girls managed to save the monkey, but they were now in an even bigger jam. 
After thinking for a minute, Audrey grabbed Maybelline's hand and jumped on the monkey's tire swing. What is happening? Whoop, whoop, whoop. Down. Wow. Ugh. Up. Woof. Zip. War dogs. Warthog snork. Wow. Strong. And up. That was my best adventure yet, said Maybelline. Audrey had to agree. Wow. So I said, White hogs? Why have to be white hogs? I had only minutes to spare. I had to save Audrey's from those beasts. Whoa, look at those kids listening to the stories. That's it. So, have you expected this end? Let me know. Let me know if you like this story. And I can't wait for your drawings and for your videos. Yeah. See you.